Hey guys, it's Iron Man here. Welcome back to another episode of XCOM Enemy Within Long War Mod Classic Iron Man Mode. So, I've been a little bit busy the last few days. That's why you guys haven't seen an episode, so I'm sorry about that. But, um, I'm back and I'm ready to, you know, continue our journey as we kick the butt of some aliens. So we're gonna keep bringing in Libra. It's a, um, scout crash landing, so it's gonna bring in an easy team. Lieber, of course, are keep getting him psychically trained up, and then we're actually going to equip an arc thrower on our infantry, Frag 85, and that's because he's a sprinter, so, you know, 19 mobility is already very fast, I want to get our newer guys trained up on easy missions, so, you know, knock down two birds with one stone, just give him an arc thrower. Anyways, I think that's gonna be it for my little pre-battle speech, let's get started. Okay, so, this mission is gonna be in Russia. Be deploying to Russia for this one. And say, uh, evening map. Major population say You said that last time, and once again, we're in the middle of nowhere. Can you stop lying to me? Strike team is awaiting your orders. Affirmative, Big Sky. Strike one is free to engage. Uh, there's not much cover down here, so we'll have to. Let's not move through here with most of our guys, because we won't be able to take every cover spot. Move a few people to the right side. It's this, this is the edge of the map, or maybe the eh, actually probably the left, because that's the direction we probably want to go. I'm on it, Commander. Looks like we're gonna have a quiet first turn, though. That's good. Everyone has like blue armor for some reason. I think I got a little lazy. If you didn't request the customization armor, I think I started sending people to blue armor. <laughs> I just noticed. Well, not intentionally. It's like, oh, I just pick which armor I want and then what color. And then I like the color blue, of course. Like. Oh no, that's a sectopod. Or maybe a mechtoid because I, you know, always make that little mistake. Those stomping sounds, I can never tell the difference. Yeah, okay, well, it is a scout, so we do get a sectopod. He'll probably be by himself. Hopefully. I don't want any trouble. This one, easy, nice, simple mission to get our. You people train them. If you notice, one of the most important things that I keep stressing is to never have any soldier have less than 80 aim. I mean, you can't help that at the beginning of the game, but by this point in the game, no one should be less than 80 aim for sure. Preferably, no one less than 90 aim. I think like Xena Snow is gonna be a little bit less. I don't know, she's 101 because she has the carbine. But, um, most of your soldiers, if they have crappy aim, they need a scope. You're gonna be relying, at least the majority of your damage on, or, the majority of your damage is just gonna be shooting, so, you want decent chances with everybody. Especially since the enemy's gonna have cover. Okay, those stomping sounds really, really, really sound like sectopods. I mean, in the past, I. I was wrong. But this really sounds like a sectopod. I don't know if it's just you, or, or so I don't know if it's just me, or maybe you guys hear it differently. But that that doesn't sound like fun. It sounds like a lot of trouble. I'm a little nervous. Okay, we're, just, we're gonna advance cautiously. This is probably a little risky to see. Okay, I guess they're on this side more. It's fine. Move you up there. Okay, let's put you like right here. You shouldn't be able to peek. Oh, you were able to peek over, but not too much. So it's okay. Maybe it's in there, Mechtoid. That stompy sound sounds a little bit more familiar. Aye, aye. 
or it's just me praying. Alien object in sight. Okay, just meld. Okay, it's fine. Let's scout up in here. Yeah, come on down. Take some high ground. Okay, nothing yet. That's good. That means we'll be able to get all this heavy cover. Okay, you're going to peek a little further. Nothing yet. Good. That's what I like. Let's go put you here. So if anyone comes, you'll be able to overwatch and get a shot. It doesn't really matter that you're facing the wrong direction. Bring you here. Let's overwatch everybody again. Those are sectoids, at least, or a sectoid commander. Okay, so maybe it is a mech toy then. I much prefer that. Oh, yep, it's just mech toys. Ah, it's a quite a bit. Two waves. Outsider leader, mech toy leader. Okay. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Where's my Rocketeer? I knew I had one. Are you in front? No. Where's my Rocketeer? I thought I brought one. Am I going crazy? Did I leave something behind? Oh man, I left something behind. God damn it. <laughs> See, this is why I don't, I don't click that yeah. Overwatch button. The auto Overwatch button, because stuff like this happens. I'm not going to be able to grab the meld, but that's okay. Copy that. Okay, I think most importantly is we need to panic these outsiders, and then we'll deal with the mutants. Okay, Kelshimo. What what would I be shooting at? Okay, Lieber, you can actually see something. Okay, my, why don't you shoot at this mech toy and then probably shoot twice? Should be able to kill him. I was considering panicking, but I think straight up killing him is even better. Actually, I might not be able to kill him, but. At least with him, but I might be able to use other people to kill. So, uh, I'm okay. I need to panic that outsider too. It's a big priority. Which I might not be able to do, which would be bad. I will keep it here, because I need to use your smoke. I don't have enough panics, I think. Yeah, probably just smoke up. Affirmative. Behind some heavy cover with my entire squad as well, so that's good. Only well, Libra is kind of exposed, but can't do much about that. I need to figure out where I want to bring you. Mm, yeah, I don't want to leave you isolated over there. What, what's your defense? Not that good, considering that you're already behind some cover. Okay, I guess I'll like dash here. And even if I don't have sight, I'll be able to overwatch. That's good. I just want to bring my whole team together so I can smoke up. Okay, ooh, where can you go? You don't have very good spots, do you? Yeah, let's bring it here. Oh, 
Oh, you have dead smoke, though, so that's good. I'll be able to use smoke these people up. Then, Kelshimo. Um, I don't reckon you throw a flashbang that far, can you? Nope. So why don't you just shoot that mech to a see Yes, you can. Either that or for him to hunker that. I wasn't sure which was the best situation. Or best choice. But it was okay to just shoot and kill the mech toy. Ooh, okay. See? Is that all you got? Uh, that wasn't good. That was a bad move. Already a bad start. You can tell me not playing's got me rusty. That's okay. He was flanking me, but I know he wasn't. And then we got the Banshee Corsair armor, so plenty of defense, at least. Keep dodging. Yeah, that's fine. Mutants have pretty good base aim, but. Nothing too crazy. Dodge it! Alright, good. Dang, you, you should get a little you should get a little goat star for being able to dodge all that. Uh hmm. I need to move my scout. Well, you can shoot twice, so might just have you shoot. Get my Rocketeer up without triggering a... Triggering an Overwatch. Okay, let's go for the shot. Please do not hit my own guys. It's a little risky. Okay, you didn't hit anything. That was a wasteful rocket. Never mind. That's why I prefer the engineer at times. Well, could flashbang these two. That's an option. Uh, I feel like flashbang one. I, I need to get a regular grenade up. Who has a grenade? Besides Joey. Uh. Why break in Overwatch? Okay. Now I think I can rotate you over here. Be able to chuck a grenade. Love this cover here. Hopefully, that's part. Of the, that's the plan, at least. Please love this cover. Alright, great. Now I can kill these mutants and reposition on the left side so I'm not in trouble there. Okay, I guess we go after the mutants with you then, because the chance to hit that outside is pretty low. Leave watch you shoot him, and then we'll have you panic the other outsider. Or I can mind fray him. Why don't we try that? It's kind of like a flashbang on him anyways. I only did one damage, so maybe the panic was better. I was hoping I'd do a lot more damage, but it didn't happen. Okay, let's see if we can... Nope. Can't. That's fine. Let's go retreat here. And smoke up again. Got a little lucky that Xena was able to dodge, but as you can see, she has her fancy armor, so... She's A-OK. -okay. Oh, good hit. Then maybe I'll decide to take another shot with you, then. 50%. Oh, nice! We got we're getting really lucky. I'm happy. Okay, um, 
Guess I'll bring you here. Okay, I'm just gonna overwatch regularly. Okay, yeah. Just wanna make sure. Yeah, okay, because their defense is so high, they're just floundering around. Oh, look, a sec toy command. I didn't even notice him. Where are you gonna do? Dodge it. I guess it's kind of good having Mind Fray and Panda because I can kind of shuffle the two disables around. Yeah, okay, but to kill them, we, we still gotta do it the old fashioned way, it looks like. Great, good hit. I think I'll shoot this other guy then. Uh, oh, 50%. You can do it. Nope. It's okay. You got two shots. Two 50% chances. Okay, looks like I need two, actually. Maybe I should just have Lever finish one of them off. Okay, never mind. We are getting pretty lucky, though. So, I'll take it. It's good to get lucky sometimes. Not the ideal way to play, of course, but... If I'm going to get lucky, I might as well take advantage of it. Okay, nope. Damn it, missed the target. Kelshmo, you have hall targeting, so... Do you want to take advantage of that? Actually, let's try to finish off this outsider. Oh, great. Hitting all of our 50% shots. And the only reason our chance to hit is pretty low lately is because... Bring in... More rookieish squad minus Robe and Robe and uh, what's his name? Panic him. So like, let me shoot first because he might hunker down. Besides Robe and Lever, that is. Let me finish my thought. Okay, we missed. That's okay. Let's take an air shot. Nope. It's fine. Maybe I should move forward and try to grab that meld. Oh well. I don't think the meld's gonna last in their turn. But yeah, had I um, panicked first, he probably would have hunkered down, and then it would have been almost impossible to hit him. Which he did just do. So that's why I shot first before I decided to panic. Or I, I could have hypothetically even killed him, and then the panic would have been a waste. He's gonna try to like, mind control me or some crap. Or oh, he's actually shooting! That was close. That's my wheels high enough, and great, the meld's still, the meld's still alive. Pick it up. Let's hollow target the sectoid commander. Okay, Lever, I need you to move up a little bit. Nope, that's fine, you can reload. Can I get sight from here? Oh yeah, I can. I'll save you, I guess. That Mewtwo up there is not gonna be not a threat because obviously he's disabled. We might try to go for a capture up, but I need to kill his kill the commander buddy first. This might be a little bit more difficult. I'll just start shooting. Great, get hit. Okay, fifty-six percent. Nope, or slowly whittling it down his cover. I don't think it blow up this column actually though. So it might not matter. Come on. Nope. It's fine. Take another shot and then we'll just reload. Oh great, I actually hit it. Dead in the water here. Reloaded. 41%, sure. I mean, I, I got so many shots right, chances are, I, eventually I'm going to hit hit one of them. And when it's only one alien alive, I'm not too worried about, you know, wasting my ammo. Especially since we have ammo conservation now. So just this mutant left, try to bring him home for the rifle. 
I got two arc throwers. Might only be able to get one in range though. That's okay. Six, uh, use my plasma pistol for my second shot. Oh, oh well. It did the maximum amount of damage there. It's okay. Don't really care. We already got plenty of plasma rifles anyways. Wouldn't hurt to have a few more for, um, like alien base assaults. But we accomplished the mission and then Libra got some more psychic training, so that's what matters. I mean, these are always the three good choices on Gunner. Take key ammo, though. And for you, close combat specialist is a potentially good, potentially good option. Get some more monies. Seventy-nine mil. What a tease. We need eighty for the alien nucleonics research and recall. Anything I can trade? Nope. I think I really want to trade. I guess we just move forward then. Great. Awesome. So maybe I should build something new then. New engineers arrived this morning, Commander. It's not really anything I need to build. To have more help down here. This is probably gonna be our hyperwave generator, and I'll blow up a lab or something for our golem chamber when we get there. So our base is basically done. Nope. Naturally, can I start any new research? I appreciate your efforts to support nope. the research team. Need more Illyrium. I've already put the new. Yeah, I have more Phoenix coil guns being Contact built. Detected. Raider. Too bad I'm busy arming. Arming takes a long time. What the heck? Commander, by ignoring these UFO contacts, we're putting our entire satellite Great. network at risk. Who else got thrown here? Anyone level up psychically yet? Small fighter, very high. You are going down. Too bad. Okay, we'll probably have to use some of our Enemy buffs then. Satellite assist acquiring target. Oh, what the heck? This fighter is crazy. Did you see that? He just went ape shit on me. Oh my god, are, are the, is the enemy UFOs getting upgrades? Because that's crazy. Okay, okay. This isn't working out. Fortunately. Yeah, that was pretty lame. Okay, how many satellites do I have? I got two available. Okay, that's fine. I, I'll launch it at the end of the month. And then my panic will down, go down anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, I don't really need more scientists though, so I'm not gonna accept that. Yeah, okay, I guess that's gonna be our next mission. Yep. So, probably bring Athalia and. Wait, can you guys level up? Is that what the symbol means? Oh, yeah, it is. New okay. promotions available in the armory. Yeah, okay, well, actually, I'm gonna throw Thalia and uh, our other guy in. So, what's this? Reach and Battlefield. This unit, all allies are healed 1 HP each turn. That's not bad. Nearby allies that cover receive plus 10. Okay, we'll take that. That's awesome. We're, we're how I said I want to keep stacking defense because it makes the aliens do stupid things and then you can dodge crazy shots that you normally wouldn't be able to. Well, this is what I want plus 10 more defense. So, I'm gonna take that. And then, round balloon, you can get. Or your wolf's freak, so I'll give you mind fray as well. Yeah, is there anyone else I can throw it? Just double check. Nope. How about an officer promotion? I'm gonna take a no. Oh, you two unlock the next billet. It looks like how much does that cost? Um, two hundred and forty dollars. That's not too bad. Let's see what we can sell. Sell some. Sectoid corpses. Maybe I can sell a few. Nah, I probably need the sectoid commander corpses for something. Sell some mechtoid cores. Usually you don't need those. And maybe 
be a few chrysalid or drone wrecks. Actually, no, I think drone wrecks I need for modules. So, if you, no, I need that too for um, what's it called? Tactical rigging. I guess they'll sell regular mutons then. Should be enough. Yeah, actually, I think I calculated it correctly to say I could get regimental officers. Purchase that. Can we get a colonel yet? I don't think so. That would have been cool if we could have. How about a new major? That was a, oh no, that person doesn't want to be psychic. Okay, um... Okay, Ariel Burke, you are a captain now. Congratulations. We will take... Well, actually, we'll take the five defense again. Good job. Is there another captain I can promote? Yeah. Tarrington, you... You, sir, can also get promoted. Then I'll make two more people lieutenants. Okay, you could be a lieutenant. And we'll get the will bonus, of course. Now, I think I can't promote anyone else because everyone else is psychically trained. Even though I have the billet available. Unless someone near the bottom of the list. Yeah, these guys, their rank is too low, so... Oh, I can promote, I could promote a gunner. Hmm. Should I? Well, I wouldn't mind gunners being officers either because they're they're going to be in the front and I have plenty of them to, you know, rotate around. So, okay, I think I will promote you then. You're, you're new, but you know what? You've done pretty well, so you're going to get promoted. Be another lieutenant. First gunner lieutenant. Congratulations. Okay, now I'm going to go set up this mission. I'll be right back. Okay, so actually, this is a terror side mission. The abductor is over Europe. I, I just caught on to that now. So we're going to bring in our A team into this fight. Just because, you know, we need to get them a little practice, and then the abduction mission, we can send in our B team. I think that'll be, that'll make more sense. So we haven't used, I feel like we haven't used Ayot for a long time, but, um, i gonna bring him in for this mission. I think mean, it's because he's a master sergeant already, so I won't get other people promoted, but. Um, yeah, for this mission, we'll, we'll be able to use this heavy firepower, and I don't think you need a laser sight. Why don't you just carry a... Did I bring a medic? Oh yeah, I did bring a medic. So what should I give you? I'll give you a... I'll give you a spare medic, how's that? Just in case our medic goes down and he's critically wounded, you can revive our medic. So yeah, I think this is gonna be our squad. Let's get started again. Okay, right, so Commander, that's our abductor. That's uh, gonna be tomorrow's mission then. We need the abduction ship, or not the abduction ship, the abduction mission. Okay, hopefully this terror site isn't too difficult. But we did bring in our A team. Seems a little strange that he didn't say anything. Usually Bradford says some things. Does that mean it's gonna be like... I'm not gonna spoil it, but I, I know there are some surprises in Long War, and then... To be honest, it's a little obvious when he doesn't say anything that something new is gonna happen. Because that's what always happens. Oh, Seekers. Okay. That's not anything special. Let's kill these right away. Perfect for Cranklin since she already has a battle scanner. But yeah, that, that's a hint to tell something freaky is gonna go on if Bradford doesn't say anything. These si seekers are gigantic. Is it just me? Okay, well, most of these aliens are probably pretty easy to kill, so let's kill them. Uh, combat rushed. That actually improved my stats that much. Oh yeah, I did 10% more aim, so that's good. I think I'll need two shots, so I'll just take two shots. No point taking cover because I know I'm gonna be able to kill everything. Like I, I'm, I'm 100% confident. 
Okay, okay, I'm not 100% confident. I'm like 99.9999% confident. Because technically, I, I could hypothetically miss every shot. And, or I could win the lottery, but realistically, I'm gonna hit everything. Or hit enough shots to kill them all. And. Do we have, a, do we have another infantry? Oh, no, it's okay. Why don't we just shoot him with a the pistol then? Actually, I could have moved you into cover. Okay, let's move you here. Steady our weapon for this door. Roger that. Okay. Okay. Steady your weapons. You can't steady, so we should have should have brought a rocketeer here then. Cause you're a gunner, gunners can't. Oh chrysalids. Oh figures. Yeah, what's that? Is that in there a chrysalid? Did they get silent me? Well, we're triggered to wave it, I'll just blow them up. We got plenty of grenades to deal with them, so not too worried. And yep, they're coming to us. Perfect! Please all bunch up. Maybe I won't even need a grenade, I can just straight up, straight up kill them all. Nah, we're not afraid of you guys anymore. Okay. I'll wait on Lakeland share. I might want to reload. Could use our double tap on our yield. So we haven't even moved forward yet, but the aliens are just rushing towards us. We'll gladly oblige by killing them all. Oh, you want you want to use your pistol again? Sure, why not? So let's rotate you. Let's bring Let's bring you here, and then when we open the door, we can steady our weapon. How's that sound? Let's not let's use a small Thanks, arms. Commander. Actually, you haven't fired yet, so we'll just use your rifle. Actually, so I'm very indecisive right now. We'll just fire with a heavy plasma. Bye -bye. Cause I think the heavy plasma, you probably have a few more shots. Or it might not matter since I'm. He already fired once anyways. Okay, I'll stop before I start confusing myself. We're green to go. Except for this door again. Steady your weapon. Overwatch. Steady your weapon. Steady your weapon once more. This is probably gonna be two more waves since this is a swarm mission. Maybe three. They're coming towards us once again. Sounds like a civilian just jumped out the window. It's like, no! You hear the glass break. Hi! Oh! They didn't react. You know what that means. Scatter point three. We got like 110 aim on him, so. Bye bye! Okay, um... So you have your weapon steady, so maybe I'll just shoot with- shoot this guy with you. Bring somebody else to finish them off. No, oh, you can finish somebody off. You can shoot and reload, so perfect. Column just disappeared. It's a graphics glitch. But we know he's still, you know, there because, or he's still behind cover because. Oh no, it's back now. Because he was still, he has still had the full cover shield, so that's like you can easily tell. I'm gonna go get someone here. Let's move Lake Lecture like, up. Okay, you actually don't get sight. Hmm. That's affirmative. That's really bizarre.
It might seem weird, but I, I can almost guarantee with my A team that if I overwatch, I'm going to probably kill him if he moves. They're falling back. Hey, he can't see these guys anyway, so it's not like he's shooting me while I'm out of cover. Yep. I actually missed one, but between the three of them, they all have like 110 aim, so figure it'd be fine. Uh oh. Sounds like another chrysalid wave. J'y vais tout de suite. Um, maybe I'll toss a bow scanner out so I can see what's past this little fishing area. It's kind of cool on the terrace sites where the um, the buildings a bit the buildings or the terrains a bit more destroyed compared to the regular missions. And two mech toys, okay. So two mech toys and another chrysalid wave. Moving. Well, advance a little cautiously since we already position. made moves on some of our people. Just set up, get ready to maybe run to the next columns and then blow them all up. Sounds like a good plan. You bring Ayot up though. He's a little bit lagging behind. Now, there is a second floor to this map too. Might consider taking it. Got it covered. The only problem with the second floor is only some light cover, and then sometimes the sight's a little buggy. Okay, I'm not sure if that's good see them accidentally. I hope not. I think I have to move to this spot to see them. Bien. This might actually trigger them. But I will get everyone into position. Okay, nope. Yeah, I, I have to move to the next ledge to see them, I think. That's good. That means I could dash I yield up to a good position. I'll just dash him yes, here. Sir. Okay, let's reload everybody who needs to reload. Locked and loaded. You can reload your pistol. You never know when you'll need just another extra shot. Yeah, okay, you gotta come to us. Yep. Kinda come to us. Okay. Fine. Oh, what the heck? Yeah, okay, well, here's our big surprise that I was, Oh, wow, this guy's really fast. That I was talking about when I said that, you know, the mission just. Alright, when Bradford didn't say anything. Got our giant, giant little friend. We're missing all of these important shots. Please do not do that. This is a lot of crystals, too. Like, hopefully, these guys just shoot at. Um, civilians or whatever. I throw flashbangs if I need to as well. Get a few grenades chucked. Start working on this, on this guy. Okay, I don't know how much HE he has, but probably a lot. So I did decent amount of damage. I didn't. Even that hurt him. Yeah, let's just fire a rocket straight down the center. I think I got more grenades too, so should be okay. Uh, also got flash veins hypothetically if I need those. Now, Cranklin actually rather just shoot because she is our infantry. Well, what, what's his will out of curiosity? 8%? Yeah, that's not happening. Okay, start shooting, I guess. Oh, 18 damage, and we've 
finally made a little dent into his HE. So he probably had like 50 HE total. That was a good crit. Good job. Okay, Lake Clenshire, you can shoot twice as well. Oh no, Lake Clenshire, why are you outside? That's okay. That's okay. Situation is under control. You're good to go. Now move. Chuck another grenade at these guys. Weaken the. Weaken them down and kill these other chrysalids. Okay, uh. It's not gonna be enough. But you can only see him, anyways, or that chrysalid. Both of them have 10 HP. Yeah, that's an annoying number. Oh, come on, Lake Clutcher. Why can't you see? Maybe I will have to end up tossing the flashbang. Actually, I think we'll be able to kill them all. But then we'll have to deal with this other crap. It's a little unfortunate. Last of weapons, OP. Yeah, let's move around, finish him off. And then we're at then we're at the mercy of all this other crap. Hopefully they just shoot at civilians and not me. We do have high elevation for our targets that are in front though. Don't mind control. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. No, oh, yeah, okay. you can just hunker down then. Yeah, that's annoying. Oh, it's seven seven hit points worth of shields now too. Right, you're just shooting civilians, are you crazy? Cause like I said, panic's not that much of an issue. Okay, okay, good, good. That was a civilian. Not me. Not me. Okay, good. <laughs> Let's see if we have anyone with heat ammo, so I can wear him down. Break the shield. Ah, oh, Twitch Blade, but he's panicked. Okay. Our medic, medic, you're gonna have to move Get forward. Toss his chem grenade up. Go. Get out of here. Yeah, I don't know where that mech toy is actually. Kind of just disappeared. Move I yield up though. Oh okay, yeah, I see him now. Uh, well, I'll probably do enough damage. I might not break through to the shield, but at least I'll shred him. Oh okay, yeah, I didn't do much damage at all. Never mind. Not good. Not 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 good. Okay, let's just keep trying to wear through that shield of his. I should really be positioning Lake Clutcher into low cover because he, he has low profile. And then I could give somebody else this high cover position. Okay, at least the shield's down. So, yeah, I'll kill him this turn. That would be ideal, at least. Okay, uh, I think I'll just shoot him then. Yeah, I'll kill the sectoid. So he doesn't come back and give an air shield. It's a time miss. That's unfortunate. And there's fire here, so I can't do anything, which is annoying. Uh, let's move here. You can already see him, so that's what you'll shoot. Actually, I should have checked to see if, it, if I had Psy Inspiration on anybody. Could have been useful for a time like this. On my way. Okay. 
It's not good. Can I just, maybe I should, can just blow up his cover. Look at that giant crystal. It's, it's freaking Godzilla here. Maybe I'll just go f and kill this, um... Kill the sectoid commander if I'm able to then. Uh, I'm not able to get sight. Okay, at least we got plenty of defense and high cover to help us. Don't give him another shield. Forward, he'll have to run through the acid, most likely. That's good. Yeah, okay, there's civilian dead. It's fine. He's fine. He's not going to even move. Going to be a jerk, kill more civilians. Okay, let's see if I can toss their acid grenade though. Since our heat ammo prison's disabled. I want to bring. No, no, not you. Okay. Can't select in one sec. There we go. Can I throw a chem grenade that far? Nope, I don't think so. So I'm gonna drop you here. And here you go. Toss a chem grenade at him. Ew. A lot of enemies are. Actually. Let's let's just kill that sectoid. Um, actually, use the pistol since it does up to seven damage, so that should be enough. Especially, I'll probably crit anyways. That was a bare way to deal with that. Now just gun him down. Too bad I won't be able to use double tap because he's out of ammo. Like, let's sure you can shoot and then reload. So where are the sectopods? You guys can bring those. Bring those up against me now. I'm not afraid. Silly aliens. Just kidding, I am afraid. I don't need I don't want those. Um let's see if I can get anyone ranged to panic. That would be convenient. Not much cover because I Acid in my cover. Okay, let's kill him at least. If we're able to. Okay, um. Well, this is probably the last enemy, so I can just run up and panic him. Yep, 100% chance. Okay, now, now I just gotta kill him. Okay, I don't want to run into the acid though. So, okay, that's gonna move into the next. Here's good enough. Just gonna finish him off and then head on home. Good job, guys, killing a, killing a crazy gigantic man-eating chrysalid. It's not really man-eating, egg implanting. Egg implanting chrysalid. I wonder how much damage it does. Well, I don't, want, I don't really want to find out. Maybe one of you guys can let me know how much damage it does. As for me, I'll just keep it, you know. Little, little corpse here. Firm this way. Actually, I'll go fire once the Lakeland shirt because I want to give this kill someone else if possible. Why don't you practice your mind fray as well? Might as well farm up some more psychic exe, right? Okay, are you done being a baby? Too bad you're not gonna get in range. Okay, either you get the kill or block this. Oh, looks like our medic wants to take the credit. This should be it. Mission accomplished. Okay. 
Good job once again, team. No casualties dealt with that crazy, crazy, crazy alien. If all our missions go as well as this one did, awesome. the aliens don't stand a chance. They really don't. We will be in touch, Commander. That's nice. Who else can I stick into this lab now? What else? Nope. Again, gain enough Zyx. It takes a very long time. Uh, can I promote anybody? Is it major yet? Oh yeah, Lake Launcher. Good job. You are now a major. All units of squad. Yes, this is the one we want. Is it me or is Lake Launcher's beard? Getting longer and more gruffy. Or maybe this is how it's always been. And I'm just noticing things. Wouldn't that be cool if, you know, their facial hair kept growing? Unless you change it. Like, like you had to give them a shave. Or maybe it's a, a bit annoying for some people, but... I swear, you didn't have this much facial hair before. Anyways, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. If you enjoyed it, feel free to leave a like. And if you want to, you know, continue supporting this channel, please click that subscribe button. So, hope you guys enjoyed dealing with that crazy crystal. Like I said, you know, it was kind of a giveaway when Bradford didn't say anything that there was going to be something special popping up. So, you, you guys might notice that on the, um, on the special maps for abductions or abductors or whatever, terrorist sites results. That Bradford doesn't say anything, so that kind of gave it away that something was up. But, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. XRM Bear signing out.